Petty cash is a fund created by a business for minor everyday expenses. This is done to eliminate accounting for many small transactions. Petty cash accounts can range from $50 to a few thousand dollars depending on the size of the business. There are three steps to petty cash. Establishing the fund, making payments from the fund and replenishing the fund. First, a business will put a set amount of cash into a petty cash fund from the main cash account. To do this, the business must debit petty cash and credit cash in the journal entry. When a minor expense needs to be paid, the business will now use the petty cash fund instead of using the main cash account. Once the fund is established, the business can use the petty cash, to fund, petty cash fund to pay for minor expenses. When a payment is made using petty cash, such as taking a client out for lunch, postage, postage expenses, office supplies or any other miscellaneous expenses, the custodian will take money out of the petty cash fund to use and in return will keep the receipt to keep track of all transactions used with the petty cash. The business will not record the transaction in the accounting journal. Instead, they will hold on to the receipt until the end of the month. At the end of the month, all the transactions used with the petty cash will be recorded in the journal entry under petty cash expenses and the money that has been taken out of the petty cash account will need to be replenished. Cash remaining in the fund will remain there and only the money that has been spent will be replenished. The money on the receipts that have been recorded as expenses plus the money remaining in the fund should, should add up to the starting balance from the start of the month. If the total receipts and cash requested to replenish the fund is equal, then we debit the expenses and credit cash. At the end of every month, the petty cash account will need to be replenished using cash from the main cash account. To account for differences in the cash requested to replenish the fund and the total receipts, we use a cash over and short entry to account for the differences. If the cash on the receipts is short, then we debit cash over and short. If cash on the receipt is over, then we credit cash over and short. This is a separate journal entry used solely to account for any outstanding balances when replenishing the fund. In summary, petty cash is useful for small miscellaneous expenses that are too small to record individually in the accounting journal. Cash is credited to replenish the fund, and petty, but petty cash is never credited directly. Cash over and short is used when there is a difference between cash needed to replenish the fund and the total receipts.